Hello and welcome to 5-Minute Math. Today we are looking at the 5th grade concept of classifying two-dimensional shapes. This is standard 5.5a in the great state of Texas and we are using item number 47 off the 2016 released star test. If you have not done so already, please go ahead and take a moment to pause the video, work this problem out on your own, unpause it, and then we will look at our answers together. So we need to find which table has check marks placed in the correct boxes. And each table has these three, quadrilateral, rhombus, and polygon. For us to understand that, we need to see that there are actually three different levels here. I'm going to start with uh, this big box. And this is the outer box, and it's actually our polygon box. So polygon is going to be the largest level here because it has anything that is closed, that means it's not open, and it needs to have straight sides. So a lot, but not all of our shapes are polygons. They're closed, and they have straight sides. Now, within our polygon, we have another layer. So think of these as like little nesting dolls. Sometimes we can represent these with uh, circles, Venn diagram if we want to. Within that, we have a quadrilateral. Now, there are some other ones that we are going to skip over, like we don't have parallelogram, we're not going to have square, rectangle, but we're just going to use the three that are on this particular problem. So within every single quadrilateral, and we will see that means it is four sides. That's it. Quadrilaterals are four sides. This, this quad means four. You notice that every single one of my quadrilaterals is going to be a polygon. So the box of, for quadrilaterals is within the polygon box. So if you are a quadrilateral, like a square, like a parallelogram, like a trapezoid, you are automatically a polygon because that means you're closed and that you have straight sides. And then our final level that we're going to deal with just in this particular video is what we see is a rhombus. So a rhombus is a special type of quadrilateral. That means it automatically has four sides. That means it automatically is closed with straight sides. It has four equal sides. So I'm just going to say equal sides. I'm not going to say four equal sides because it automatically has four sides since my rhombus box is within my quadrilateral box. So sometimes we see shapes, we call them diamonds. They're actually rhombus. So that's just one example. Equal sides. Now, let's take a look at what we have here. Our circle. Let's just look at take a look at A. I'm going to start right here at our circle. Is it? I'm going to start at polygon, just because that's the outer one. Is our circle a polygon? No, it is not a polygon, because it is not a, a, a shape that has straight sides. So automatically, our circle is wrong. A circle is none of those. We have a triangle. Triangle is a polygon. It is not a quadrilateral, and it is not a rhombus. So the circle is incorrect. That is correct. Next, we have a parallelogram. The polygon is correct. It is a four-sided shape, and it is not a rhombus. So actually, everything is good on A except for that circle. It's not a polygon. Let's check B. B square. First, is it a polygon? Yet yeah, closed and straight sides. Is it a four-sided shape quadrilateral? Yes. Does it have equal sides? Yes, it does. Did you know that a square is a special type of rhombus? It's a special type of rhombus that actually has four right angles. So that square is good to go. That triangle, it is a polygon. It's not a quadrilateral, not a rhombus. So those two are good so far. Our rectangle is a polygon. It is a four-sided shape, and it's not a rhombus because the sides are not equal. So B is looking good. Let's see what's going on with C. C. Well, see, that square should be a polygon, so that's automatically wrong. And so should the triangle. That's automatically wrong, and so should the rectangle. Okay, so C is just not working. A is not working. Let's check D. Circle is not a polygon, correct? Not a quad. So this looks good. Triangle is a polygon and is not a quadrilateral rhombus. That's good. Look at D. The, the parallelogram is a polygon, but it should be a quadrilateral. So our answer here is B.